Hi everybody, in this quick tutorial you'll learn how you can add movable points to Desmos Activity Builder screens. So let me show you a few examples to see what we're talking about here. In this one I've given students a box and whisker plot with 12 movable points and students are challenged to drag the points to positions that could be points in the dot plot. And I have 12 points here and notice I can only move them side to side, not up and down, just side to side. Here's an example of up and down points. Here students are given five different points and they're asked to move them so it creates a data set with a mean value of three. So students can move any of the five points. So let's find out how we add these movable points to an activity builder. So I've started a new activity builder screen here and in my screen I'm going to add a graph. And the best way to do this is by using a table. So I'm going to use the plus sign and make a table. And let's say I'm going to point a point at negative 5, uh, 1. So it's just added away there. So I had this point. To make it movable, you're going to use the settings gear. And under the settings gear now, I'm going to come to this green point. Notice the point is green. Click it. And I have some options here. And the ones I'm interested in are the drag options. If I click this guy with the crosshairs, this makes this a movable point in any direction. And notice that the table updates with the new values of X and Y for this point as you move it along. But if I want to just make it an up and down point, I'm going to click this again, use my settings gear, and now I can make it an up and down point. So now this point can only go in one direction, up and down. What if I want to make a series of points? Well, let's make a new series here by uh, making a new table. And I do want a group of points here. Let's say I wanted one at one, uh, one, maybe one at two, one, Oops. Uh, maybe negative two, one, maybe negative four, one. So I'm just going to create five points here. Negative five, one, five black points there. Use the settings gear, click the black point, make them all drag, and notice they're just, there's this little ghosted outline around them now. That indicates that these are movable points. And I can now slide these wherever I like. So this is how you can add movable points to your Desmos Activity Builder presentations.